happy Halloween or happy Halloween when I was recording this. But uh, um, you guys are getting this November 1st. Welcome to my amazing YouTube channel. I'm glad that you stopped by to listen to my review of one of my all-time favorite artists now. I had the absolute honor and privilege to be able to interview the amazing Samoke on my YouTube channel. It was, it was so much fun, so many jewels and gems. It was actually a dream come true because I've been trying to speak to Samo one-on-one, -on -one, not like in an interview format because I never I never thought I'd be interviewing him, but I just kind of wanted to get in his head and be like, oh, like, what makes you you, you know what I mean? And I got that with the interview and I was so happy. So, shout out to Samo, y'all go follow him. I'll link his Instagram, his Twitter. I'll put it on the side of iMovie is kind enough to let me do that with this stupid new text feature. I'm gonna be talking about his two new projects that he dropped in the same month. Ugh, hungry am I, um, hungry. Let's stop worrying about the words I'm messing up and let's get into this review of Alpha and Clear. Now I decided to review these in one video because they're not lengthy projects. They're pretty, pretty a, a decent amount of time. Uh, Alpha being 23 minutes and Clear, I believe 17 minutes if I'm remembering uh, correctly. So I'm just so excited and let's dive on in first. Let's talk about Alpha, which released October 30th this Friday. Let's get it. Ah. Put the candy down. Uh, <laughs> so Alpha. Alpha is his I want to say second album. Y'all are going to correct me and crucify me in the comment section, but I'm going to put it right here if I'm correct or not. But it's coming straight off of Exit, which I love. Y'all know I adore that album. That album is honestly a 10 out of 5, a, a, a 20 out of 10. It is an amazing project. It helped me emotionally process so much. His vocal range, the lyrics, Exit is just a top tier album. I'm honestly saying that because the level of artistry put into Exit is just remarkable. I honestly love that album so much. It, it resonates so much with me. I, I know we're about to talk about Alpha. Let me get off Exit. Let me get off Exit. Let's go into Alpha. Um, so Alpha consists of 13 songs. Like I said, the clock's in at 23 minutes, I believe, 47 seconds. Like I said, I'll correct myself uh, as well, because I know you guys will. Um, it goes, and I have a list right here, because I'm terrible at remembering how songs go. It goes, I am clear, us at night, mi amir, which in Spanish, I'm probably saying all the way wrong, in Spanish, uh, to English, translates to my love, Oshan, Naomi, Sex Guy, A-S-E, Black Story, ABS, I'm Frankie, 2911, and Uncle Kenny. So, what did I think of Alpha as a whole? I thought Alpha was great. I honestly loved this. It was so good, so enjoyable. It felt like it's very different from Exit. Exit feels like he's leaving a part of his life. He's telling us stuff like... I thought I left that early. Boy, if you don't. Gonna kill me for that trap. <laughs> but, you know, he's just talking about leaving stuff behind, going into new things. And it very much feels like he's leaving and going into another stage of his life, which leads to Alpha. So, I, actually, that's really well titled. A props to Samo for that. But he's leveling up in life. He is an Alpha now, and now he's, he's talking his ish. He's talking about what he wants, you know. He's talking about what, like, what he is. And I just really adored this uh, project. It's really good. It's a really good album. Very solid. Now, I would give it a four out of five. Now, like I, I y'all just heard, I was praising the freak out of Exit. Now, I'm not giving this, uh, what stops it from being a five out of five for me is, um, it just, it just there was, I felt like something was kind of missing that I really enjoyed in Exit, that I, I, I honestly loved in Exit, and, um, there goes the ring. Um, but I honestly loved an exit that just wasn't present here. And I guess it was just the time of my life that maybe I'm overhyped. I'm no, I'm not overhyping exit because exit is really good. And there's something in there, an exit, like, I don't know how to explain it. It's, like I said, Alpha and Exit are very two different uh, projects, albums. 
but I just enjoy eggs a lot more than I enjoy Alpha. Now, that's not to put Alpha down and say it's garbage. Like I said, I love Alpha. It's great. I gave it a four out of five. I love the transition from clear to us. At oh, my God. Let me talk about the transition from clear to us at night. It's perfect. I love how it starts with, like, water. You know, like, them zen waterfalls. And, like, and then it goes with some moves. Like, hey, hey, hey the vocal god that he is um i can't do him justice y'all know that um from me saying earlier but it just the vocal god himself just going in and then it goes to it we be up at night <laughs> six in the morning us at night is a very good song i don't know what's how to put my finger on it but alpha is just missing something that exit has and maybe it's because of the stage i'm at in my life that i can't really I don't want to say I can't relate to Alpha, but it just, I don't know. Like I said, this is not a bad album at all. It's not at all. And I'm going to give it his props. Clear Us at Night. Oh, Black Story and ABS. Oh. Y'all honestly got to drop what y'all are doing and listen to Black Story and ABS. The Black Story to ABS is so good. So ABS stands for All Black-ish. I don't want to say that because I know YouTube be on that censoring-ish. Black Story is like where Samoa's talking like in this white voice. Honey, come come see this. They're thriving in their own community. <laughs> Samoa is an actor and a musician and he does it flawlessly. Um, but, you know, it, it was just talking about some our ancestors, you know, lynch them and like take them from their kingdom and he was talking like that and I was, I was just having it was like he was having so much fun with it and it was so fun to just listen to how he talks in his verbiage i want to say he's trying to be at this white man i was gonna say coon in abs where the guy was like i pledge allegiance to the stars even though i'm black we all know that white is right so that's basically about coon he was just talking about some Oh, ancestors ain't living fair when that ABS, like he was talking his ish in ABS, talking about some the stimulus hit, but the rent still do. Oh, the rent still do <laughs> with my 40 anchors. And, oh my gosh, I'm all over the place, but um, yeah, man, ABS Black Story, great. I love, I love them both. Sex Guy was dope. I remember when that dropped, that was that was a banger for me. You want some more? I deep your love can go into his <laughs> Y'all probably think I am crazy, cause I am. But uh, I'm just, I'm just enjoying. Like I said, Samo is in my top favorite artist of all time. He's just amazing. Can't give him enough praise. But yeah, I really enjoy four to five. Please go listen to Alpha very good and i love it um my love i just loved i oh i also love what i also loved in uh exit was the little parts where he's like talking to people or they're like giving him it, like, some more advice or uh, giving it feels they're giving us advice you know while talking to some more they're giving him advice and giving us advice i just always loved that with um i believe it was on frankie it was talking about having a mentor and wishy uh, she had a mentor when she was younger someone who doesn't over hype you and agrees with everything you do and also someone who doesn't disagree with everything you just have a mentor you know what I mean so I very much relate to that and I just love those little talking uh, points that he has and I've always loved that about Samoa's project but yes another homeborn for the great Samoa and Alpha is a definitely a go by <laughs> let's get into clear time for all that you've done to me. So this is another project he dropped this month, like I said, which is honestly it was really dope to me that he dropped Clear and Alpha. And he explained that uh, in this interview he did with himself. Really go funny. Really go funny. It was really funny. Y'all go to his Instagram and check it out. Where he did like this uh, black editor at Vogue. Um, so he talked about doing Clear before Alpha. I'm trying to remember because it was... Um, you know, you got to clear, cleanse yourself before it can ascend to that higher alpha level, you know? And that's why he dropped clear. He said he uh, wrote alpha first and then clear later. But clear, I haven't really listened to a lot of new albums this year, which I need to change. 
clear is astonishing. And this just goes back to emotionally it resonating with me. And he said this was like a virtual hug, and it was. Because guess what your boy did? Was in tears. <laughs> I was I was just, I forgive Alter, uh, Sean F Fuller, Lingering, Vail, Josiah Basie, Be Okay. I forgive. Talks about forgiveness and forgiving someone. For the dirt they did to you and man i get choked up just thinking about it um because i like i said this relates to, like exit and clear relate a lot to me where i am in my life um where where i am talking about forgiving people who have done you wrong and have done you dirty and and you know it's more for you than for them you know i hear that too sometimes um, i've heard that before and then we have Alter, where it's just, like I said, the vocal guy, Samo, that he is. Just like, I felt, I felt like I was in a church. God, you know, a pastor was giving the word and, excuse me, um, just giving the word. And then Sean F uh, Filler, Fuller, what do I say filler? It's not F-I, it's F-U, Fuller, um, just talking about how he made this EP for someone and know how they he somehow misses them and the house was quiet without him and then we go into lingering which talks about i'm in the house alone feelings coming on so strong mm. Mm -mm -mm. Samo <laughs> need to work with kirk franklin i could really see that Samo kirk franklin collab collaboration i would love to see that he's i'd be so dope but this relates to us in quarantine and us just dealing with our thoughts and hosting on field and us missing people and just us having to do FaceTime or Zoom is just, it takes a toll on us. I I know a lot of you can relate out there where this year has been very emotional. It's taken its toll on us because it's just been so much. And lingering is just talking about that. Quarantine, being in the house alone with your thoughts, facing yourself. Um, Veil, I believe Veil was another one of those like talking things. And then we gotta go to Be Okay. Be Okay is my favorite. Sorry, like y'all already know, Be Okay is my favorite off of this uh, album. EP, EP. Be Okay is. I will be okay. I will be high. Be okay. Do -do 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 be okay. Oh my gosh. I love Be Okay. This is amazing. Manifesting what I want. Ooh! I just I feel like a, I feel like a church lady right now. But honestly, Be Okay is so good. It just talks about you're gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be all right. I know times are tough. Times are rough. 2020 is, bleh, but you're gonna be okay. You're gonna be okay. Everything will be okay. It's gonna work out. Just give it time. Keep hope. Keep love. Just it'll be okay. You're going to be okay. And um, I love the okay. I give some most clear five out of five. I love clear, and I do personally put it above alpha. But that's not a diss to alpha. I, I feel like people are gonna think I'm dissing alpha. Like I hate it. I don't. It's a great project. Like I said, y'all go buy it. It's it's great. But it didn't do what Exit or Clear has done for me. And that's not a bad thing. Y'all could probably hear the ice cream truck out. Clear did something for me that I needed. Alpha was just great, turn up, fun, love, awesome. Just a mostly just great. Us at night. Like I said, the transition from Clear to Us at night is top tier. Y'all. Go listen to that. Black Story, ABS. Go like the Alpha has hits. I'm not saying it doesn't. It has hits. And I love it. But Clear just did something for me that I needed. Shout out to be okay. I shall be crying to that tonight. <laughs> kidding. Kidding. But yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed my review. I'm sorry it was kind of all over the place. Um today's been kind of a 
crazy day. Halloween, of course. I hope you had an amazing and safe Halloween and got some, uh, some, some, some candy. Uh, um, but yeah, guys, tell me what you think. Uh, do you prefer Alpha over Clear or Clear over Alpha? I would love to have a discussion about this amazing artist, but what I want you to take from this review before I end it is that Samo is an amazing artist and is a great person and y'all need to go support him because he's great. Go at him on Instagram at Samo Music and I believe I, that's his Twitter too. Samo Music, yes, go at him. He's amazing. You won't regret it. One of the best artists out right now. Anyways, guys, leave all your comments down below. Hope you enjoyed this video. Have an amazing day. I will see you on my next music review, which will probably be dropping Monday. Yeah, it will be dropping Monday. Kind of late on that review, but hey, school is crazy. <laughs> so, hope to see you guys around. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Peace.